Now, we are getting the geometric mean and we are told that if A, B, C, comma, dot, dot is a GP, then B is the geometric mean of A and C and is given by B is equal to plus or minus the square root of AC. Example, find the geometric mean of 96 and 384. Now, by the definition of a GP, we know that the <coughs> geometric mean is the number between other numbers in a GP. So since we are told to get the geometric mean of 96 and 384, we know that we are getting the term between 96 and 384 in this particular GP. So the way we do it, we say, the geometric mean is equal to plus or minus the square root of 96 and 384. Now, when we consult our multiplication, we are going to see that when we multiply 96 and 384, we are getting 36, we are getting 36, 8, 64. And when we get 36, 8, 64, and we get the square root, we are going to see that the geometric mean of 96 and 384 is plus or minus 192. So meaning that in our GP, the number that should be between 96 and 384 is either negative 192 or positive 192. So basically this is how we get the geometric mean when we are given two terms.